All right, guys, this is Ben Bailey, and welcome back to the channel. Uh, some people were asking me about my Jixer 1K that was in the video the other day uh, with the intro to the Busa. So I'm going to go ahead and do a little walk around video of it and uh, explain to you the mods and uh, the goals with the bike and what's going on with it this winter so I can go ahead and get uh, get it up and rolling. So, all right, I'll do a little walk around and go from there. So basically, this is my 2008 Jixer 1K. Uh, 08 was the only year of the gold and, bl and black. Uh, this bike's also ceramic coated with System X Max. Um, and she is actually really dirty right now because I have not washed this thing in a while. I also, mod wise, I have all short stacks, uh, Sprint POA air filter. Then I have the Brock's pentacarbon exhaust. You'll hear that in a little bit. So, I mean, it's a beautiful exhaust. And then also have, I have straps. But uh, a buddy of mine needed some, and I forgot to bring my other ones to the house, to his house. So I just took them off my bike. But winter mod-wise, we've got the lowering link. We've got the straps. These are the Brock straps that you can get on Brock's Performance. They're great. And then I have DME front fender lowering brackets because I'm going to go to a shorter tire. And then on off of off of Amazon, I have this Terrazon rotor. Now this thing's pretty cool. It drops about a pound off. But when I do the build and I'll video it, you're basically going to see where uh, what the weight the weight of this is compared to factory. So basically, right now the goal with the bike is just have a stock wheelbase, fun street slash roll bike. Also want to do some uh, eighth mile just have fun with it stock wheelbase and uh right now the bike's best is 6.6 six at 117 so it's pretty quick and then i also do my own tuning and there's a few more mods tuning wise that i'm going to do to it before i put all the woolwich software back on the busa so basically right now is i'm going to do the mods on the busa and then do the mods on the 1k get that dialed in and then get this one dialed in because it's super cold here and not really anybody's going to the track and I don't really care to go to the track when it's like 30 degrees because you're not hooking. I mean, at the tracks around here, uh, shoot, I, once I, they only prep to the three, 300, 330 mark. And then after that, like the boost, it just breaks loose. Like the rear end just busts loose. Um, it is stock shock, so that might be a reason as well. But this bike, it, uh, I'm also stock gearing. Everything else on this bike is literally stock. I'll also be pulling the forks off, and I have to rebuild the forks because last time at the track, uh, I did a, my clutch decided to let go in the middle of, well, I did a retune. I updated the tune and went to launch. Whack the throttle open, start feeding the clutch out, and it blew through the clutch. There was no slip. It blew through the clutch. So I know the steels are warped, so I have to redo the clutch on this thing as well. But what happened was, was it basically picked, just immediately went to about 11 o'clock. And me, I just, I just kind of, I tried to roll out of it, but it went bam a little bit too hard. And... It, that said night night to the fort seals so after all right so basically i'm gonna take video of replacing fort seals and all the mods on it as well because maybe it'll help some of you guys when you're trying to do it because we have a cherry picker and a cherry picker makes a world of a difference so just uh stay tuned on that and then right here in a second i'm gonna open a garage door and you can get, you guys can hear this brock spin of carbon all right, we're going to turn this thing on. And this is a cold start.
All right, guys, well, that was a little cold start of the pentacarbon, a little action. But, uh, yeah, I'm pretty much going to be doing some videos on these two bikes. And then when it warms up, do some drag videos. So just like, share, subscribe, and, uh, you know, shoot me a message if you have any questions. Comment any questions. And, uh, yeah, I'll get to them. Don't mind my hair. I got to get a haircut. See ya.